What's cracking, all you beautiful creatures? Welcome to 2017. We're your 2016 survivors, Carl Sami and... Max Cal. Happy New Year. Yeah, we're kicking off the new year with a survival game called This War of Mine, made by a small Polish developer called 11-Bit Studios. Hmm. The game was inspired by the siege of... I'm not sure if I'm saying this right, Sarajevo, which lasted 1,425 days in what used to be Yugoslavia, Ooh. which incidentally is where our family came from. Our roots. Yep, that's our roots. We're going to do a custom game made with custom characters from Twin Opinion, so you'll see myself, Max, and your Ekis, even that dastardly bill collector and you'll get to see us work together trying to survive trapped inside a besieged city. I already tried my first run of the game to learn the gameplay mechanics. It was a complete disaster, but we're still optimistic. With, uh, with a little knowledge gained in that first run, perhaps Twin Opinion will survive the Civil War of 2017. All right, uh, I've got the game already set up. I think I've got things pretty much set up as for a standard game. Uh, yeah, this is the first time I've uh, really got to see this game. You told me about it, and now I get to see it firsthand. Yeah, all right, so uh, let's go ahead and start our journey. Or start the story, as it were. Day one. Oh, it's black and white. <sighs> and uh, what year is this supposed to be now? Yeah, I think it's... What happened? Well, I don't know, Max. I, I don't know whether to say thanks Obama or this is Trump's America, but I mean, all we know is the situation is not good. So here's the cast of survivors, like I said, Max, myself. Oh, you got to <laughs> I just Rikis. noticed the pictures here. <laughs> yep, yep, I got us all in here. The war has been raging on for countless months and supplies are getting low. Hopefully the residents will be able to band together and manage to survive in these tough times. So the first thing we're gonna do is start uncovering some of this rubble here and start looking that for the first time we materials. arrived at this little housing. No, what are you doing? You should be uh, here. You can clear this rubble. So the controls of the game are very simple. It's all. It can all be controlled with the mouse, although there are a couple of hotkeys on the keyboard I can use. Mostly for sw switching between characters. I'm just looking at the HUD there. See, we yeah. got a time and temperature. Uh-oh. Senior Ekis is already slightly sick. It's day one. What? It's day one. He's already sick. What the heck? What Aren't the heck you supposed to know about that stuff? You're like a doctor and sh <laughs> wow. Yeah. Not off to a good start. Ah, okay, we're finding some materials here. Okay, we're gonna need herbs. Yeah. I forgot, if you double click on a location, they'll run over and... Oh. Ah. So yeah, we're gonna be finding construction materials, uh, electronics, wood, water, some basic herbs. Oh, that oh, door's locked. locked. So we gotta, we gotta get a lock pick to bust through that, I or think. Maybe you can find a key in the debris. Yeah, maybe. I'm not sure if there are keys, but I'll have to check. Oh, you're not working. Senior Ekis, I don't care if you're sick. Search the cabinets. So I'm gonna wanna put him in bed pretty soon just to make sure he recovers. Yeah. The only w guy who knows how to fix our computers. Yeah, he is our uh, 
our electronics expert. Of course, uh, Bill, the bill collector, is persuasive. What do I do? I made you a skilled wood chopper. Ah. Mostly because uh, all the good jobs are taken. So, Max, you're our wood chopper. <laughs> uh, no. Not too bad. I, I learned oh, nice. a little bit of woodwork at, during our high school years. So the jewelry's not good for anything except trade, but we're gonna be doing some trading as uh, as things develop here. Yeah, it may not mean something now, but once the world gets back into order, people are gonna be wanting that. Mm-hmm. Gotta have hope. Yeah, this is true. You gotta have hope. Ah, we've got another locked yeah, door. That's over kind here. of my tagline for 2017. <laughs> yeah, Max, going into this new year, Max has repeatedly said we gotta have hope. But, well, it's not always easy. <laughs> oh, right, there's a whole backyard area to explore, too. Oh, cool. We've got a tree house. Oh, can we get a. Can we get a dog? I don't think so. Aww. Maybe in downloadable content, I don't know. I know they recently added like some extra characters and I think uh, you can get a... Uh, I think there's downloadable content that adds like children, so you have to take care of kids during oh, <laughs> Siege 2. All right, cool, we've got That's two lockpicks. Look after someone else's kids. So we can use these lockpicks well, to... There's a tree house, so yeah. This stuff out. This wouldn't be bad. Actually, let's. Let's try to open this door, maybe. Alright, Senor Equis, you've done. You've done enough. So, we don't have any beds, so I'm gonna try to build one. <laughs> Really? You have to build beds? We do have to build beds. Ah. Oh. Luckily, we've scavenged enough to make a bed. I'm going to put one near the front up here, I think. I think we got ripped off here when <laughs> renting this place. It's a, it's a fixer upper. <laughs> it's a fixer upper. Oh yeah, just zoom in a little bit. So my guy's a photographer, which kind of makes sense. I'm into photography, so I've got a keen eye for detail, which means I can find so more items, hypothetically. So you're kind of the surveillance guy. Yeah, so I'm going to be going on a lot of missions. Yeah, so uh, what exactly does Bill Collector do? Uh, he's persuasive. So he's, oh, so he has his charisma. Background. And... <laughs> I think he used to be like a financial manager or something. I... <laughs> Makes sense. So yeah, I'll, I'll pop up all the bios so you can see. I'm not going to read them. You can just pause it and read it if you want to check it yeah. out. <laughs> so you've seen your Ackies. So are they randomly generated? I'm not sure, actually. They might be. Max, our, our skilled wood chopper. <laughs> yep. Yeah. All right, we've uh, we're making good progress for day one. Oh yeah, Bill, why don't you go up here? And open this door. Must be easier to create characters for this game. Yeah, it's pretty simple. There aren't a lot of choices for uh, uh, character models, but I mean, you can upload any photograph you want, so that's that's still pretty cool. Yeah, at least it's something. So this is still locked. Are we already? I guess we're out of our lock picks already. It's okay. It's okay. So since we only have one bed, um, that means. Only one person can get a good night's sleep at a time <laughs> for now. Hopefully we'll we'll build a one or two more. 
when your characters get too tired, it does start affecting their health and their their mor like morale and yeah, their abilities to perform. The first day, not too bad. We've cleared out all the rubble. Yeah. Looks like except for this, but we gotta we gotta get a new lockpick for that. Um, let's see. Yeah, it looks like we've we've picked up all the items we can get. Yeah, it looks like the. Sun might be close to setting. Yeah, yeah, it's getting late. Oh, 7.40. So the night's going to begin before too long. Ooh. Let's see, maybe I should make uh, something else here. Nope. Oh, the night is upon us. So during the night phase, you get to assign um, jo the scavenging. You, only one person can go out and scavenge during the middle of the night. So you choose a scavenger and then you choose your guards and who gets to sleep and who sleeps in a bed. Whoever sleeps in the bed yeah. gets a you know a good night's sleep. Probably be Senior Ackies. Yeah, since he's sick, he's going to get the bed. Um, what am I going to do? Let's see. We could have someone guard. Early, this early in the game, uh, having guards isn't quite as important because people aren't quite as desperate. We're probably not going to have any issues. Um, but I hate the bill collector, so we're going to put him on guard. He doesn't need a good night's yeah. sleep. Max, you can sleep. I'm going to go out since I've got too much for the ship. And as, uh, as time goes on, we're going to be unlocking more areas in the city right now we can check out a shelled cottage which it looks like it's got a lot of stuff actually oh food so that that's a that's that looks good this also looks good there's a family here though that we might encounter i don't want to steal stuff from them so let, let's let's go to the shelled cottage yeah now, if I had a weapon or like a saw or a shovel to help bust through debris, I could bring that with me. Or if it's an area where you think you might encounter a trader, you can bring some items to trade with. But it's uh, we're unlikely to find a trader here, so I'm just gonna hop right in. All right, good luck, and hopefully uh, we'll pick up some internet while you're out. I'll I'll see what I can do. Oh, you get to control this part. Uh, looks like there's. Yeah, usually it's randomly generated. Ooh, a lot of surprise. Oh, a lot of supplies. Oh, oh I should have I should have written down what we need. Um, start with a lot of you. Uh, could use some more wood for building. We're gonna oh, yeah. need to build a lot more stuff. Wow, those are good. I should go look for some food though. If we could get some food, that would be really good. There is a refrigerator there. I'm peeking through the yeah, door. So I'm make guessing sure. they're not going to have animal-style fries here. Uh, let's see. Let's see any animal-style fries in here. No, not quite. There's a decent amount of food in here, actually. That's oh. that's quite good. Um, so we're going to... We might have to drop some of this yeah, stuff. Yeah, we'll drop you. We'll drop some wood. We'll get all the food. And then, hmm. yeah, I'm already filled up. This is actually a good start. You want you want to start gathering food early. You want to start gathering supplies early. Also need the wood. Yeah, so I'm going to go ahead. I could look and maybe try to find some better items, but I think this is probably fine for now. Oh, there is... There is this rubble I can start clearing, mm. so next time I show up, I won't have to deal with this. Well, won't somebody else come by to pick some of this? Um, in my experience, uh, it, I don't think so. See, if we had a shovel, we could dig through this much quicker. I'm guessing the shovel saves some time. Yeah, yeah, it definitely does. It's already 10.30. I've never found a shovel or a saw out in the wild. I think you have to make them yourself. There's no tool sheds around here. Plus, somebody else already took all the good stuff. Man. 2017, man. It's We're not off to a good start. 
It was a rough election year. I guess people just had enough. Now here we are. It's not about whose fault it is. It's back to the matter. I mean, we should just be glad that you and I are still together. We're in perfectly good health and it's gonna be roses from here. It's <laughs> you just gotta keep positivity. Stay positive, have hope. That's right. So I think after clearing this rubble here, I'm gonna wanna probably take off and try to get home. If you stay out too late, it uh it can be dangerous. Your guy can get hurt, they can disappear, they can get die. sleepy. They, yeah, they can get sleepy. <laughs> oh, is that a coffin to the left? It does kind of look like a coffin, doesn't it? <laughs> <laughs> Hope not. Yeah, you should probably leave after this debris. Yeah, I gotta say, my impressions of this game have been pretty positive so far. I really enjoyed my first run, even though things didn't go as planned. But I did have one survivor, although uh, he was traumatized for the rest of his life due to the horrors that he witnessed during the siege. Oh, so there is an end game to this, like the Oregon Trail. <laughs> yeah, and I think uh, you get a different ending depending upon how healthy and how well off your people were during the siege. Yeah, so there's replay value to this. Yeah, definitely. Cool. Let's see if there's anything up here other than fire, which, you know, I'm a fan of fire, but... How long has that been going on for? <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I hope it doesn't burn down the place. That didn't happen in my first run. I don't know if it's possible. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and click on Run to Exit. And that should oh, cause me to run, run to the to backyard. The, yep. Carl is back. Well, we survived day one. I wonder how Senior Eckes is doing. Yeah, hopefully he's feeling a little bit better. Wish I could bring so much every night. No in and out though, I'm sorry. Damn. Senior Eckes is still not feeling too well. Darn. Hmm. Let's you gotta see. build us a TV, man. Slightly sick and hungry, so. Everyone else, uh. Slept poorly. Alright, I don't think I'm gonna start feeding people right away. So I want to make sure we've got enough food in the long term, but I will give Senior Eki's a meal. Eventually we can uh, build a stove healthy. and then cook better meals that are more satisfying, but for now we're going to be eating raw food. So you're going to go back to bed. We're going to, I'm going to have to build. We've eaten raw food before. We've had sushi. Let's see. Oh yeah, I should build a radio pretty soon too. It helps you keep track of weather reports and what's going down in the city. You can uh, see so if certain I items are worth more. Sometimes there are like f certain shortages of certain supplies and if you, you have them readily, you can trade to do better. So let's see. Yeah, let's yeah, see. Yeah, so not all is lost. They'll listen to some of our favorite tunes. Okay, where do we want the second bed? Uh, sure, that's that's fine. That's yeah. Then Paul, right next to the laundry. Paul, I'll have Paul build a build a radio if I can, if we have enough supplies. Yeah. Okay. Good. We're gonna need this, and we'll yeah. put you. Uh, hmm. Yeah, that's what fine. Okay. I need my rock tunes. Max slept poorly and is hungry. He's not very pleased. You can have sit a coincidence in a chair. because the last couple of nights I haven't been sleeping well. Oh, really? 
Yeah, well, last night wasn't too bad. Oh, it's been raining hard around here. Yeah, we just uh, had a big storm come through. Let's see. Okay, I guess even though you're tired, you're not ready to sleep right now. Paul is tired, though. We'll have yeah, him go to bed. You stayed up all night yeah. protecting us. I guess it's the least we can do for him. So let's check out the radio, see what's going down. More atrocities committed by the military. Ugh. That's not good. That's not good. Many innocents are already feeling the pinch here. Okay, the weather's holding out. I don't think winter's gonna come for a while. That's good. Let's see. Usually I come to later in this type of game. Yeah. That's some classical music. That's nice. Let's see. I wonder who's running the military now. The city remains cut off. The government forces do not allow any aid to reach the city. It's mm, not good. Uh. Let's throw on some classical music. So let's see. What else can we build? A stove. Yeah, that is a stove. That is a stove. A crude stove. That's probably moonshine. I've never built this before, but you can make alcohol to help uh, with depression. <laughs> I know that's questionable, but uh, you can also, you know, trade alcohol for for good supplies later on. Uh, rain collector. I don't think we'll need that. The metal workshop is pretty useful for when you get weapons later on. I didn't use it much last time because I failed so hard. Let's go ahead and build a crude stove. Yeah, let's get some warm food we'll around. Build that in the kitchen. Well, what am I gonna do? Let's see. Wait, can we upgrade our workshop yet? Yeah, let's do that. We'll be able to make more stuff. I'd like to build a heater pretty soon. We won't need it for a while, but when winter comes, you you need a heater. Otherwise, you will not survive. The winters get very cold in Yugoslavia or wherever this is supposed to take place. <laughs> can we build all right we've we've used up a bunch of our supplies oh you can actually build a guitar <laughs> yeah I didn't build a guitar before we should have one later though yeah help with the depression as it starts sinking in I know things aren't too dire yet but they will become dire yeah. as time goes on so some folk music. Yeah, let's see we've built all we can build I don't I'm not gonna feed anyone anymore for now so let's go ahead and end the day. Cause sometimes people will show up and knock on the door, but usually they come by now. So I don't think we're gonna have any company today. So, so yeah, let's go ahead. And, around. Yeah, let's the the day. end the day for now. Yeah. Question is. All right. Okay. So new out? areas have opened up. Oh, quite a few. Um, let's see. Carl is tired. But I'm gonna have him scavenge again. <laughs> oh, we'll have Max sleep in bed. Bill, you're a jerk. You need to guard. I hate you. Senior Ekis is still sick, so we're gonna keep him in bed. Poor guy. Yeah. Um, let's see. You know what? The shelled cottage seemed like it had a lot of stuff still, so we're gonna we're gonna head out there again. And hopefully uh, and nothing can, has changed. And we could find some weapons. Yeah, that would be good. That would be good. Or at least some weapon parts. If you get enough weapon parts and a broken weapon, you can build your own guns. Grab 
grab everything for now. You need water in order to cook. Uh, the teddy bears are they're good for trading. Yeah. Guess they'll be especially useful if you have the children DLC. Yeah. Let's see. Which are free, I'm sure. I'm gonna leave that for now. I'd like to find some more building materials if possible. Some food and building materials. Fire's still going. Ooh, this is very useful. You need the bandages if you get wounded. Um, grab another teddy bear. I'll leave the meds here for now. Ah, eh, actually, Senior Ekis could use that. So we'll, we'll add some more meds. Let's see. What's in the coffin? <laughs> Hopefully not Dracula. Okay, so we've got wood down here. What do we got in here? Ah, it's locked. So we gotta find yeah, or trade for a lockpick. You can build lockpicks eventually, but we don't we don't have the means to do that. You need a metal shop for that? Uh, I believe so. Yes, yes. We got here more building supplies. That's kind of what we need right now. We'll grab one of you. Uh, I'll leave that slot open just in case. Was this locked? Yeah, it was. All right. There's still quite a bit of stuff to collect here. Yeah, yeah, there really is. You tend to find all sorts of stuff near the beginning, and then as time goes on, of course, things become more scarce. You start encountering more danger. Ooh, here we go. Some more weapon jerks. parts. Oh, yeah. Some books, which are great for... The fire. <laughs> what? <laughs> um, I know this is a little weird, but I'm actually going to grab this fertilizer. Because you can use it to uh, either grow food or you can set up traps and use it to lure rats into the traps and uh, get some barbecued rats up in here. Mm. Yeah. Yeah, okay. So this was a good scavenging session. I think we're good to run to the exit for now. Now my guy's going to be exhausted, so I'm going to have to put him to bed right away. And yeah, have somebody else scavenge for, for a while. Oh, here we go. Signs of life. All right, day three. I hope that doesn't mean we were robbed. And it's loading the results. <laughs> okay, Paul, what happened? Oh, the night was calm. Got plenty of supplies. Good. All right, that's good. I'm going to send Carl to bed because he's exhausted. Max is still hungry and grumpy. Let's see. All right, it looks like Senior Equis has overcome whatever it was that was affecting him. Awesome. Now get to work. Yeah, we're going to put him right to work. <laughs> uh, let's see. Easy bum. What do we got here? What do we got? Oh, Whoa. you know what? We really should board yeah. some stuff up. It's not important now, but as time goes on, we're, we're going to need... We're going to regret it later. ...extra security. Um, let's see. You were guarding all night, so I'll put you to bed. Carl's sleeping. That's good. Max. Stop watching me sleep, dude. That's creepy. <laughs> I know you're just checking on me, but... You've been out for two nights, man. All right, let's see if there's been any change in the news. Any more shortages. Yeah, things are slowly escalating. Uh-oh. So this means the chances of being looted at night has gone up a bit, so... Yeah, certainly Might not put up more little... guards tonight. Yeah. Um, what's the weather going to be? Yeah, no change, no change. Turn on the classical music, that'll help me sleep. Let's see. It 
just noticed the backdrops on these walls kind of have these little shifting uh yeah it's got images. that kind of uh make it look like it's animated yeah sketched out let's see so this is what we're gonna want to build pretty soon is the trap for small animals that'll really help us out during the winter hopefully it would be nice to build a couple traps actually my last game I only had one and it was just enough to keep things going during the winter which I'm sure was terrible it was a awful winter alright we still don't have lock picks for that space up there that's okay hopefully a trader will stop by today usually they come uh, by about now so it doesn't look like we're gonna have any visitors today it's to be expected it's really not until later in the game you start getting uh, visits from traders more often once things grow more dire I suppose yeah let's uh let's see how much time do we have well I think Plenty. we could do one more night here so we'll go ahead and end the day again I know it's a little early but we pretty much did everything we can do everyone's hungry but no one's starving no one's suffering that's good so I'm gonna put everyone on guard <laughs> just in case um, keep scavenging and we'll go back to the shelled cottage because it's safe and it's still got a lot of stuff so yeah this first video as you can see it's not going to be too interesting it's it's not until uh, things escalate that we start getting more interesting choices yeah. and until you get some more log picks yeah so we'll grab all this need more building supplies so I think after this you might have to get a lockpick before uh, coming back and there was wood in there is that locked? yeah that's locked all right hmm I don't remember if I grabbed everything up here yet not quite Oh, still quite a bit of stuff here. Yeah, we'll go ahead and load up on those. And, uh, yeah. I'm gonna just check and see what's over here. I don't remember. Later in the game, we should start taking notes. I might need you to be a note taker later on, Max. It's the only way we can survive. That's right, we had some weapon parts here. Some mechanical parts. No, Actually, you can probably make one more trip before getting a lock pick. Yeah, I think you're right. Coffee. We don't need coffee. We don't need cigarettes. Those are luxuries. Plus, I don't smoke. No. All right, that was the first four days of this war of mine. Things aren't too interesting yet, but. Stick with it, stick with it. After a few weeks, we're all gonna be suffering together and it's gonna be great, great footage. So <laughs> we still need to build some traps to catch rats. We still need to build a heater to survive the winter. We will be doing that in the next video. So until then, have hope. Have hope, people. Gotta have hope. Thank you for watching. We hope you enjoyed the video. Twin Opinion cares about your opinion, and your participation keeps us alive. So share your comments, hit that like button, and subscribe to the channel. You can also find Twin Opinion on Facebook or visit our website at asamiero.com.